Well, how do that, chums? Tis I, Captain of the Steves, and today, chums, I'm going to be playing No Man's Sky. I'm going to be running the weekend mission, and that's to collect loads of underliving water pals, I believe. I'm doing this in VR. Okay, so here we go. Let's give this a shot, shall we? Oh, it says collect five Hadel cores. What? That's not right. It should be pearls. Well. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I don't mind collecting Hadel Pearls, but I'm fairly sure that's not the mission objective. <laughs> okay, well, maybe it is. It wasn't on my PlayStation 5. Okay, well, let's, let's jump on in then. Let's fly on out. But I'm fairly sure this is probably going to change to living pearls when we fly on out, people. We shall see. I guess. And away we go. Brilliant, eh? Got you out. I do love this cockpit. I mean, we've got all these lovely buttons, all these lovely switches, even on the ceiling. But um, they don't actually do anything. Hold on. My ship is called Casa Guardian. I did not call my ship that. It's renamed itself, people, back to its original default. That's annoying, isn't it? OK, right. Well, where's my planet then? Here we go. Here's my planet. OK, let's engage pulse. Go! Hammering through the stars, Captain Steve heads towards planet, ocean planet. Oh, lighthouse base? Okay, oh, I better not be locked onto a base. Okay. Here we go. We're locked on in. Let's fly on down and let's take a look at what we've got, shall we, people? Yeah. Now, to start the mission, or at least to start the Living Pearls mission, we had to land pretty much roughly where the target was. Luckily, I've got the uh, ocean landing gear. So this should not be a problem. Okay. We're coming in a bit hot. Let's slow this down. Okay. Let's just engage my drive a little bit. Let's try and... Let's try and... Uh, bring her up a bit. Bring her down just a tad. I don't want to go too fast. Okay, here we go. And land. Land, 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 land. There we go. Sweet. Now this side, I've got a wall. I don't think I can get out this side. This side, I know I've got a cup of tea there, but I have drunk my cup of tea. So hopefully I'm not going to knock it over when I get out my ship. Sweet. Okay. What a gorgeous ship it is as well, peeps. I mean, look at it. It's freaking gorgeous. Oh, there we go. We've got to collect living pearls, not Hadel cores, like it told us. I put the old Nexus cube. So, we have to find living pearl pearls. And they're going to be in these yellow clammy gits. So let's go over there and let's go and have a look in one of these clams. Now, we do only have to collect ten. Now, what I might do is collect maybe the first two. Just to give you guys an idea of what the actual mission's all about. But I think me collecting the first two would probably be more than enough to actually demo this to you. So, here we go. Zap! And grab. Zap and grab. Zap and grab. Whoa! Look at those guys! Hello, guys! Wow! Look at them go! A little bit terrifying, actually. I mean, if these things were bitey, if these things would actually hunt you down and try to bite you, that would be pretty darn freaking creepy, wouldn't it? Okay, right. There's one over here. Dum da dum 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 da dum dum da 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 dum da da da. I better grab some oxygen. Let's go grab that quickly on our way to there. Yeah, give us that. Sweet. It's lucky I've been playing the old VR fishing game, pulling back all that. Oh, there we go. There's two in a row. I'm a little bit of. It's going to close before I get there, isn't it? Happy chow. Hop a chow. I can grab them from miles away. I like this. Those guys are freaking freaky. Okay, right. Well, we've got the first two people. So, you know what? I'll reconvene when I've got, like, one more left. Hold on. It says I've only got one more left to go. How the fudge is that a thing? All right, fine. I don't mind. Swim on over this way, then. There we go. I'm going to get this done lightning quick, people. I think I'm getting used to the controls a little bit more now in this. Up a chow. 
Go on, I'll have you as well. Uh, gotcha! Okay, right, cool. We better grab some more oxygen. Come on. Better head back to my ship. Then again, I might be able to just call my ship to me. Let's have a look. Quick menu. Ship. Oh, uh, no. Whatever reason, it's saying I can't. Alright, fine. We'll just swim back there then, people. Okay, we need to get rid of this. And then I can engage my lovely thrusters. Wow, those big freaking underwater worm creatures are pretty darn cool. I really do hope that they add in deeper oceans and more vicious creatures if we do see these purple systems come in to iteration, people. I kind of feel that we need deeper oceans. Now that they've given oceans the overhaul, I think it would make sense to make them a little bit more less tranquil, you know? I mean, I've obviously got the landing jets from my ship, because there it is. It's, it's right on the water. Hiya! Can't do the melee strafe jump. And um, I think my jetpack's going to run out just before I get to the ship. Oh, maybe not. Oh, it did. Okay. Let me in! Yes! Okay. Where have we got to go? Deliver the living pearls to the secure depot. There's the marker there. Right, how far away is that exactly? Get it locked on. 17 minutes away. Okay, well we can do something about that. Up through the atmosphere. Up where the air is clear. Where there's less friction. And that 17 minutes should turn to like 17 seconds. Okay, right, there we go. Captain Steve, Captain Steve. Flying through the galaxies. I guess. Well, nearly there, people. I don't know whether I can do the pulse. No, I can't. Okay. Ah! Stop it! Just go! Okay, it's not quite 17 seconds, is it? Okay, let's go a little bit higher then. Maybe I haven't exited the last cloud barrier or something. Now let's go back down. Whoop! 58 seconds. I can't pulse to it. No, ah, wrong button. There we go. Let's just hope we haven't locked onto the base. No, we haven't. That's good. Sweet. Almost there, people. Sorry about the the wrong button pressing. I'm still getting used to the old VR. That's not an approximate location, is it? I guess it is. Okay, right. Well, we'll just land here then. Okay. Well, what's that? Oh, some cactus or something. No, it's not. I don't know what that is. Can I please just land? I want to land. I want to land. I'm pressing my land buttons. Okay, what does that say? Okay, I don't know what's going on there. Freaking land. Well, it's not letting me land, people. So that, that, that sucks. Seriously, what's going on? Am I on a tree or something? I can't move now. Oh, this is weird. I've pressed every blinking button. I know the land button, though. I know the land button. It's not letting me land. Well, where are these guys going? Aha! Well, that wasn't there five seconds ago, was it? Okay. You took my landing pad, you get bag. Okay, come on. It's not letting me land. I'm pressing the land button. Like a freaking devil possessed. Oh, is that me landing now? Finally! I'm pressing the button like... Weirdness. Oh, there's someone's put a base on here. Could that be why? It could be why. Okay, right, here we go. Let's get out. Let's go and deliver those pearls. Yeah, look, there's a teleporter there. It's probably some sort of online multiplayer glitchy mechanics who freaking knows 
Right, here we go. Let's hand this in then. Accessing, deliver said items. Thank you. I'll be on my way. Hello. You look like a washing machine I once had, but why are you... Oh, it's because I've sort of selected you. You go with that shiny colour. Just wasn't used to seeing that. Obviously, that doesn't happen in uh, non-VR, does it? All right, here we go. So back on up to the old Nexus. Well, the Space Anomaly to the Nexus Cube. Yeah, still have people pulling me up on that. Oh, it's not the Nexus. I know, but how many things in this game are called an anomaly? Yeah. I mean, for a start off, you start up in the game as being an anomaly. Okay, quick menu. Space anomaly. And when you use those diggy doohickeys in space when you're pulsing around, you know, they bring in anomalies. So there's lots of anomalies. So, you know, I just, I think this should just be renamed to the freaking Nexus. You know what I mean? Sweet, because I'm an anomaly, you're an anomaly, this is an anomaly. Things we find in space are anomalies. But the thing in the middle of this is called a nexus. The nexus cube. I think we should just call the whole damn thing a nexus. I should do a partition. Not a partition. That's something to separate rooms, isn't it? A petition. Petition. Yes. Okay, let's head on over here then. Let's interact with this. Let's claim my quicksilver. Why do I want the quicksilver? Well, I figured... It's quite a lot of Quicksilver, to be fair. 1,800 Quicksilver. I'm thinking about buying the living egg, or whatever it is. The void egg of a Johnny Five. And doing the living ship mission. As long as this footage is okay. As long as I've got no glitchiness going on and sound blips and stuff like that. Because, of course, I've got a stream from my headset wirelessly using my wireless internet to my computer. But not only that, I've got to have my laptop on to do the capturing. So there's two computers already connected to my network. If they both decide, oh, I'm going to update freaking Windows at the same time, well, I'm screwed. I've up my internet right now, but even still, that would not be good. Okay. That's the joys of PC streaming, you know? You've got all this to think about. And then what if OBS updates? Or what if No Man's Sky updates? Yeah! Ah, oh, fun times. Anyway, people, here we go. That's my lovely ship. That's done. We've got some Quicksilver. I'm going to go watch this back, see how good it is. But if it's good, I might do the living ship Starbirth mission all in VR. Yeah! That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Till next time, people. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Yeah, yeah, wrong mouse.